Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. We're continuing our playthrough of the NES classic, Crystallis, and we return you to the next episode, currently in progress. Awesomeness awaits. Alright, so after that slog through the second entrance, we finally, eventually, made our way to the Emperor the second time. We found out that Emperor Dragon was a dragon. Um, not clear. Okay. Some of the, some, it's weird how some of the lore is not included in the game. It's in the manual. And it's in other sources. Like, uh, somehow you're supposed to find out that Azteca was actually a, an android that was left behind by the creators of the tower. Or maybe, maybe we're going to find out about that in this go around. Cause I forgot there's some pre-recorded messages that uh, show up. So let's, uh, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll save the storyline stuff that we might have missed for for a minute, and uh, let's go about uh, let's go about clearing some dungeons. No, that won't take me back. Okay, I've got my warrior's ring on. I got my refresh ready. I got my opal statue ready, just in case. And we're on the busted floating tower. The Tower of Old and Busted. Is that a name? It can be. Is that a door I can go through? No, that's not a door I can go through. Oh, Arr, I hate flying things in this game. Oh, wait a second. Oh. Maybe I should have had barrier at the ready instead of refresh. Um. Then what are those air sentry? Because they're not supposed to be invulnerable. Oh. Oh, is this another one of those? I need. I need the the power ring handy. Oh! Oh my! You know what? Did that get everything? No. Oh yeah, I forgot. The Psycho Armor replenishes health if you give it a minute to, to work. Alright, uh... Oh. Come on. I get why they're not giving you money. Yikes! No, no, I need hit points faster than, uh, just... You know, why, why am I... Oh, and I just burned an opal statue. Doggone it. Yeah, I'm, I might just die and return back to the save state. Because I, I think I just botched this up eight different ways. We're going to rest here for a second. Because I just botched that massively. Yeah. Yeah, I just botched that massively. What I need to be doing, I, I just need to be loading up the power ring. Charging up the storm. Boom. Unleash the thunder. Then uh, switch over to Dio's pennant to replenish the magic. That's what I need to be doing. Alright, so I'm not going to hang here too, too long. what I thought. Shoot. Uh, 
<laughs> Maybe this is why I remember the game taking longer. Because I need to take moments like this to uh, let my magic replenish. I'm sorry. Th th this is so I have time to enjoy and savor the last map of the game. Because literally, once we get to the top of this tower, there's one, two, three, four, four floors, and then we hit the top of the tower. And once we get to the top of the tower, we hit the, the final boss. The final, final boss. Like, the Fini boss. Um, yeah. Alright. I got enough that I can at least unleash another storm, so let me get my power ring. Let me get this charged up. Let's, uh... Oh! Remedy! I just wasted that, didn't I? Yep, I did. I did. You know, let, let's just let, let's just load. Yep. Look at that. We we got our full magic, our full health. We got our opal statue. We got our power ring. We're gonna throw a little barrier at the problem. Um. Let's charge this up. Let's kite as many of these guys as we can this away. Ow! Oh, come on. All because I turned. Oh. Gotcha that time. Waste of that. Oh! Criminy! What in the world? I hate you guys. With a deep and abiding passion. <sighs> Let's take a minute. No, because you won't give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> you must move. The game will not let you not move. All right, at least these flying guys don't shoot stuff at you. So can, if you can at least get them to come at you straight. I'll let the armor heal my health. I'll, I'll let the magic replenish. Actually, I probably don't need the uh, power ring. I think my issue with the, the guy that was blocking... I keep forgetting. The game won't let... You, you shall not be distracted. Um, I keep forgetting that the, uh, the, the thing that was blocking the lightning had its eye closed when it was blocking. So, it must be one of those, one of those game mechanics where, just like the Emperor Dragon, uh, you need to let it, 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 its eye needs to be open to kill it as opposed to closed. For serious. I hate these things. I hate them with a, ah. Uh, Mm. And how weird is it that we're taking on robots with a sword? With a sword now? How weird is that? Come on. Give me my magic back. 
feel like I should just keep sitting here doing this. Is he just gonna fly straight into my sword every time? I remember this being a little less frustrating as a kid, but I also wasn't live streaming this as a kid either. So it, it's easier to be... <laughs> it's a lot easier to be patient. Oh. It's a lot easier to be patient when you don't have people watching. the other opal statue. It just, if I end up having to do this over again, I end up having to do this level over again. And that was the last guy. I seriously wasted an opal statue on that. Alright. Oh no, I'm Junior. Mezia, these messages are for you. You both were part of a team of scientists who created this tower. As the most critical link, you were preserved to witness our future race, to judge if there's hope for humanity. Never mind, I'm not going to go there. When the tower began operating, your life systems were engaged and you both were awakened. Oops, I, I didn't mean to do the whole... things. Nope, not barrier. Refresh. Because I keep forgetting. Yeah. Because I was close on that one. Oh. Come on. Could you face the right direction? Take a minute to do the necessary replenish. Cause I wanna I, I've got I've got no magic rings, so I couldn't use them even if I wanted to. And I gotta replenish my magic somehow. Oh, criminy. I need to be still <laughs> Come on, come on. Are you kidding me? Let me let me be! Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah, the, this part I don't miss about the old games, where they made things difficult in the wrong sorts of ways. Like, oh no, you're at the last level! We, we can't just let you sit there. So let, let's, uh, I don't know, let, let's have things randomly fly at you. Stupidly hard to hit things. <laughs> Come on. Ah, oh, you bum. <sighs> and and I, would, I wouldn't have minded stocking up on stuff, too. You know, like I, I wouldn't have minded taking them, getting a moment to to 
buy a couple more magic rings or, or stuff like that, like... Especially when you know you're near the end. Let's, uh, let, let, let's try to get a, um, at least enough magic saved up that, uh, that I can do another. I wonder if once I clear the floor, those guys will keep coming at me or not. This is getting old quick. Maybe instead of the level one ring, I should try the, uh, uh, the shield enhancing ring. try the shield ring because they're shooting at me so that would be ranged And I don't have enough magic for uh, lightning bolt. Yikes! Nope, 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 nope. Oh! Can I wait here? Is that an option? Is this a safe spot? Nope. And it resets the floor. Ah! Oh. Necessary. Come on. Kite over this way. Ah, and it closed this eye. You. There we go. That fixed your little red wagon. Take a breather. Pop off the magic. Or at least as much as... This is why I'm going to quit. Early. These guys. These stupid little helicopters. I, I just... I need a breather. I need a breather. Give me a breather. Let me replenish my life and magic in peace. Please? Please? Good thing we're not on a timer. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep doing this until he keeps falling on my sword. Yeah, there you go. Ah! Let's, uh, let's... No, I know I can't drop it. I didn't want to drop it. I wanted to come back here. Ah. 
This is why I'm gonna murder you all. Especially you randomly appearing nuisance. These are the guys that I need to kill. <sighs> These guys are not fun. These guys are not my friend. Alright, I got the warrior ring. I got refresh. Let's do this again. Let's try this again. We'll, we'll just uh, keep bringing the storms. It's okay. Hey, hey, you're going the wrong way. Come on, kite this way. Kite this way. There we go. There's a good automaton. Come on, open your eye. In the storm. I took a lot of hits on that one. Many were uh, most likely unnecessary. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That. That was completely unnecessary. This game was fun until we got to this part. Th this is just ridiculous. The endless flying things that, that that keep jumping in there. Like, you can't have a minute's rest. We, we couldn't have that now, could we? Oh, what's that? You want to buy a magic ring? You've got 16k on you? Oh, I'm sorry. No vendors. No vendors. No chests. <sighs> Maybe we won't finish it today just because I can't get over get done with the stupid flying tower. Because these guys... Ah, oh, you... How did you... Everybody else ran right onto my sword. How did you avoid that? Is it because I blinked? Oh wait, no, this isn't Doctor Who. <laughs> this is not entertainment. This is pure, unadulterated frustration. Uh, oh, come on! More serious. This is unadulterated ridiculousness is what it is. Alright, you know what? That's close enough. Time to bring the thunder. Let's stay just a little bit further down. first batch. <laughs> Game struggling with rendering. That's okay. That's its problem, not mine. That's two. Oh. Oh, because I don't have enough magic. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Fine. There we go. Alright. We got our stairs again. get my pendant. I'm going to try to replenish some life and magic before I go up the stairs, and then I'm going to see if it'll let me save on the other side of those stairs. But I don't have to fight with these guys again. Oh, are you kidding me? Ah! Ah! 
I stay here? Is that enough that uh, the stairs are still in view? I'm not going to get cheated out of my stairs. They're not going to mystically disappear if I walk away for too long. Now there's three of those stupid doors on the next level. Does that mean I get three waves after I clear clear out everybody? Oh, criminy. This is the kind of stuff that makes you try to find a save game editor. Or, uh, you know, figure out where in the hex dump you gotta change something to give yourself a couple more magic rings. I mean, theoretically. Theoretically. Honestly, I've never done that with uh, the emulated games, although... Technically speaking, the emulator supports the old Game Genie codes. Wait, do, do you guys remember the Game Genie? It, is this going to be one of those uh, those moments where Ray Esther Pinky can remind me just how old I am that I remember the Game Genie? Uh, for those of you... You see, kids, back in the day, the classic NES, there was this uh, aftermarket product you could get called a Game Genie. It was a little device that you plugged into the end of the game cartridge and then plugged into the, Super, in, into the Nintendo Entertainment System. And with the Game Genie, the console would boot the Game Genie, which would boot the game. And the Game Genie would alter the communications from the console to the cartridge and back. So instead of typing ID QFG like you would in a, a PC game to get your cheat codes, you would flip to this mini phone book sized list of codes. And when the Game Genie booted it up, you could put in the codes and it would do its magic on the other side. And uh, so you would have infinite lives or uh, unlimited magic or uh, it, it just depended on the game and, and what what um, what things the developers left in the console and what things were easy to alter when you're talking about going through from communication between the console and the cartridge like the console's checking with the cartridge on what to do when you level up and the and the game genie intercepts the reply from the cartridge and goes oh you get strength not plus two but plus 20 uh, you know like that kind of stuff and, and so it, I mean it was cheating it was absolutely cheating but it made some of the games fun. It made some of the games actually playable because some of the games from the classic NES, you you think this right here, what's going on is frustrating. This ain't nothing compared to some of the other games. Like, I, I don't, I don't know who did the play testing, but it was not your average 12 year old kid. Cause, uh, mm mm. Mm mm. I mean, we're not talking E.T. bad. That was bad in a different sort of way. Uh, look that one up. There's one of the, there. There's a special place in the uh, Arizona desert where all the old E.T. cartridges live. All right, let's get our warrior ring. Let's. Uh... Oh, I can't save. All right, so I'm gonna go file save state. No. Ow! Ow! Are you kidding me? Alright. Yada 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 yada. Team yada yada yada. Alright. Can we... Uh... Let's try not to drag everybody into this, shall we? That's gone. That's been the biggest. Okay. 
Okay. So far, so good. Ow. So far, so good. You gonna give me a chance to top this off? Oh, you. Oh, you. Bane of my existence. Alright, I'm gonna try to clear this level and then I'm gonna take a breather. Uh, this is already running a little long before breaks. Oh, I hate you flying things. Deep breath. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. <laughs> it's not helping. Oh, now he flies dead at me. Where I need to stand? Will, will he fly dead at me if I'm standing here? I'm almost back up to full magic. Uh, I'm gonna try not to let it go down to zero again. That seems to be a big part of it. Uh, oh, you bum. I hate these things. Flying critters. Charging this up, that'll be pretty close to done. That door is cleared. Ah! charge off. <sighs> I guess not. That's alright. I'll fix your little red wagon. There we go. Back to the magic replenishing pennant. And watch out for flying things that are almost certainly going to come from a direction that makes us hard to, uh... Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe this is the place to stand. Come on. That is it. Follow my sword. Sorry. This will only take a minute. Since I'm still technically in a combat area, is probably not going to uh, let me save. But after so after the message, I'll do another uh, save state in the emulator. That way, I got some way to back up without having to go all the way back to the beginning of this tower. Because this is painful. This is absolutely painful. Uh, but I will finish this tonight. 
just because the stubbornness has kicked in and I will finish this tonight. It gonna happen. Rias has given me a look about saying the stubbornness is kicking in. Uh huh. Now she's giving me a look about me commenting on her giving me a look. She forgets that, you know, the face says a great many things. If you're ever wondering why Rias doesn't appear on camera, that is why. Uh, sometimes her face speaks volumes. <laughs> oh. 55. There we go. Warrior ring. Up the stairs. Give me the message. Did you find Azteca? Okay. Here's where we find it out. Okay. Did you find Azteca? He was an android created by us and programmed to lead the people in a positive direction. <laughs> uh, I got news for you. We can only hope he will succeed. We used all our resources to create him. If he fails, then it will be up to you to decide their fate. <laughs> I got news for you. No, I can't save. Okay. Let me go here. Let me go file, save state, save state. All right, and while I'm at a title screen, it's time for a break. Well, that was fun. Unless I died. Then it was a little less fun. I hope you enjoyed the series so far. The next episode should roll out tomorrow, unless tomorrow's a live stream day. The current schedule is over on my Twitch profile. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, do follow in Twitch. That way you'll get notified when I go live, allowing you to chat along as we record the next six episodes. Or chat along with whatever else I got going on. I do a variety of things, just like here. Speaking of here, if you're not already, please do subscribe to the channel. It really helps out. Click the bell and you'll no get notified of all the new content produced from future Games Revisited episodes to Coffee Craft Livestream Archives, Instrument Repair, Upgrades and Construction, and uh, anything else that strikes my fancy. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and if you have any questions, quips, queries, quandaries, quotes, complaints, comments, or quibbles, just uh, leave those in the comments below. Have fun. Enjoy, and I'll see you next time.